Hi, I'm Dr. Rasya from Dr. Dikshit Cosmetic Clinic, Bangalore. Most commonly, black spots on the nose can be blackheads, they can be freckles or sun damage, or they can even be pigmentation like melasma. So how do you differentiate all the three? Black spots on the nose, which are more near the tip of the nose and the sides of the nose, could and which are associated with lots of pimple and oil secretion, they could be mostly blackheads. These can be treated very easily with some exfoliation in the form of retinol-based cream or glycolic acid-based cream or simple treatments like glycolic cleanup. The next thing that we have to worry about is a pigmentation problem called freckles. Freckles are usually seen in some families where they appear like a small spots of pigmentation on the bridge of the nose, which is a central area of the nose, as well as on the cheeks. And when this happens, you are actually going to see uh, that you know it keeps increasing with age, it keeps increasing with uh, uh, sun exposure and these are very again very tough to treat because they are uh, chronic skin lesions. So use your sunscreens very regularly, use a broad spectrum sunscreen every three hours once and that will make sure that this pigmentation doesn't become worse. To take away the freckle however, you need to see a doctor who can do a mild treatment called Q-switched NDAG laser and this lightens out the freckle pigmentation to 70-80%. The third condition which is very resistant to treat is a treat condition called melasma. Melasma is a hormonal pigmentation but it is commonly seen in women but nowadays we are seeing it more commonly even in men. Because of the change in the lifestyle, this uh, problem has become very predominant and again it has to be diagnosed by a doctor. Once it is diagnosed, melasma can be treated adequately by using a sunscreen as well as skin lightening creams which are retinol creams and kojic acid creams. There are a lot of creams in the market which have a lot of side effects and these are the hydroquinone based creams or the steroid based cream. So it is preferable not to go and buy an over the counter cream. Please consult your dermatologist because they have your skin's best interest at hand.